Already so many accolades for this woman, Bianca Belair. The following contest is a triple threat match and is for the WWE Women's World Championship. Introducing the challenger from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. Before dominating here in WWE, she was a decorated collegiate athlete. Yeah, but let's talk about some of that dominance here in WWE, Michael. Bianca Belair, a former Royal Rumble winner, a multi-time women's champion as well. It's starting to look like there truly aren't any limits that Bianca Belair can't reach. You know, she's the first female competitor to hold two world titles at the same time. Became the first women's double champion when she beat Charlotte Flair at WrestleMania. Yeah, but every once in a while, that much confidence can be detrimental, especially when you're a target. Everyone wants to make a name off of the man. the top, a complete disregard for the rules, a complete lack of morality. The nightmare is real. It just got a lot more frightening. Superstar to get a pinfall or submission will win. There are no disqualifications. There are no countouts. And the WWE Universe has their eyes glued on this one. Spinning kick to the gut. And Lynch was scouted there. Answer after answer for each other's offense here. Oh, knee right in the spine. What sort of game plan works for a superstar going into a triple threat match? You absolutely need superior ring of 
awareness. Far too often we've seen superstars forget about the other opponent and end up getting blindsided. Inverted DDT. And her countouts mean she has the whole outside to play with. I guarantee you that chair is not going to be used as it was designed for. determined to outlast and outwork both of her opponents. In that case, Saxton, I'd say mission accomplished. 